What's up, guys? I'm John. I'm Sharice. And we are back with another tight medical movie review just for you. And tonight we're reviewing Boy Kills World. Boy Meets World. No, I'm kidding. Don't it, say it, that. It, it is Boy Kills World. Boy Kills World. Yeah. With Bill Skarsgård and uh, Sam Raimi is the executive producer of this movie. And you know what? This movie, a lot of people didn't know about it. They didn't do a lot of marketing for this movie. But I've seen the trailers because I'm a real movie buff. So I watch everything that's coming out. And I want to give my honest opinion. I want to go see it. So at this point, Boy Kills World trailer was off the hook. I was like, oh man, this is going to be an exciting movie. Lies. It was like, boom, 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 boom. Lies. The trailer makes the movie look bad. I, I have a totally different opinion on this. Apparently, Maybe, this is why we have two people to give two different opinions. Like I said, when you see the trailer, you know it's going to be action packed and a lot of killing. Right or wrong? You might see some killing, but there is some like things in the trailer, which I won't give it away, that makes the movie look like it's going to be kind of cheesy. And you're like, well, maybe. No, definitely not. De definitely not. I, I totally disagree with this. I thought it was a really good trailer. I thought it brought people in to see the trailer. And at that point, when you go see the movie, you're going to be real, real happy. That's just my opinion on it. So let's get to it. So Bill Skarsgård is the main character in this movie. Something happens to his mom. He said he's going to get revenge and he starts training like you wouldn't ever believe. I mean, he's training his heart out. He finds this guy to teach him how to fight, teach him how to train, gets him stronger. And at that point, one day he decides it's time to really go after this character. Um, one of the other main characters in the movie, and at that point, assassinator. So at that point, that's what Bill does. Period. We don't character. want to give away the entire movie. <laughs> so John can't even talk about it because it's actually it's pretty twisted. It's awesome. It's awesome. It, it's so much action and so much violence. You're going to love it. <gasps> it was so good. It was, it was I really good. I loved all the action and all the violence and all the killing and all the blood. Yeah, it was, it was, it was super cool. Uh, the fight photography, the cinematography of this movie were, were off the chain. There was all different kinds of killing I've never seen before. Yes. All different types of killing. Like people getting killed in ways I've never seen. Not on film. So so cool. Not on film. Very graphic kills in this movie and a lot of graphic kills in this movie, which is really, really cool. Killing. I thought the storyline was really good. All in all, man, I'm gonna give this movie at least a at least a 4.3, maybe 4.4 right in there. Because it was really good. I thought, you know, as far as the storyline was good, obviously the action was awesome, action-packed, a lot of killing. The cinematography was awesome, it was directed, was really cool too. It's original style. It wasn't just a just the normal scene to scene. It was really, really good. The transition to the movie, everything was good. So at least a 4.3, maybe even higher, but I don't want to give too high of a, a rating away because... Because Wolverine and Deadpool's coming out and, and that's going to be that's, a high point out. That is probably going to be the highest be rated movie of the year. We all we'll, know. We we'll all see. Know. I don't want My to set the expectation. My rating on this movie is definitely going to be a 4.0. I really, really wow. like this movie. That's good. For all the violence. Especially because I went into the movie like, eh, the trailer sucked, like I said. And... I was like, well, I didn't, you know, I didn't know any of the characters. I, I knew a couple, actually. Let me take that back. But I was like, eh, I kind of went into the movie that mindset. But of course, I'm here with my husband of, you know, forever, forever, forever. And I need to enjoy my time. Yes. I'm like, well, a better movie just makes it even that much cooler. Yeah, um, but it was just good. It was a good movie. It had a great storyline. It kept me in tune the whole time. Um, and then the end was a real good twist. It was. I was one of those like, oh. Didn't see that coming. Good fight scene. Really and good, lots really of good fight fighting. Scene. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I mean, lots of killing yeah. and lots of fighting. <laughs> it was great. So if you like violence, you like action-packed things, <laughs> you, like violence. You, you like the fast-paced movies, this is going to be the movie for you. At that point, you go see it for yourself. It's your opinion on what this movie is good, bad, or not. So we'll see you next time at the movies. Me and Sharice, we're going to head home, eat some dinner, and go to sleep. We appreciate you guys. Check out the next movie review just for you from Type Medical Center. See you at the movies.